So today we're at a beautiful craftsman style home here in Portsmouth, New Hampshire, where we recently installed the Mitsubishi electric heating and cooling system. Now this home was built around 1850, which generally that poses some problems for us. Not much room to run ductwork in the attic, also not much room to run ductwork down in the basement. So this was a great example of a house where the homeowners had had several HVAC contractors approached them with solutions that didn't really make sense for the house or were not going to completely provide a complete solution for the home. For indoor units in this home, we've got a dedicated unit behind me here in the master bedroom. We've got one in the sunroom. We've got one on the first floor in the kitchen area. And then there's one more upstairs in the office. All of those indoor units are paired with a single outdoor unit located in the back of the home. This is the outdoor unit that takes care of the four indoor heads that we spoke of. This particular customer hid the outdoor unit behind some lattice work. It's important to note though that the unit needs adequate airflow. So if this was any sort of a solid structure, it would, it would not be okay. You'll also notice back here that we've used fortress enclosure up the back of the building that has been painted the same color as the house. That houses the refrigerant lines and drainage that go between the outside and the inside components. We've got one indoor unit here that takes care of the master bedroom, the adjacent bathroom, closet, and a small office as well. This unit provides heating and cooling to these spaces, utilizing the standard Mitsubishi handheld remote control. This is a room that the homeowners use a lot, so it's important for them to keep it nice and cool during the summer. Sunrooms generally present a problem for us as, as HVAC guys because of all the solar glare and the glass, they tend to be much harder than the rest of the house. If you had a conventional air conditioning system located in the basement, it would be very difficult to treat this room itself as its own zone. With Mitsubishi Electric, we were able to install an individual indoor head to take care of this room so that the homeowners have dedicated control of this room in the summer and when they use it, they can cool it down to their liking. We have another indoor head located here that takes care of this open concept kitchen dining space as well as the adjacent living room. Now in this instance, we were actually able to route the line sets down the wall into the basement and across to the outdoor unit. In this situation in particular, the homeowner was a little bit skeptical of the aesthetics of the indoor unit, but once we installed it, and since they've had it installed, they themselves have even said that it blends into the background and that they don't even notice the unit here anymore. So this house is such a great example of a challenging install with discerning homeowners who were a little bit skeptical of the Mitsubishi Electric product at first, and then ended up having such a great experience with not only how the system came out, but with how it performs for them. We're installing several of these systems every week in homes and offices across the seacoast, and we love to help provide a solution for you. If you're interested in finding out more about Mitsubishi Electric or anything HVAC related, give us a ring or check out our website, eastcoasthvac.com.